Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiya ala muhammad wa ala alayhi wa sahbihi wa sallam ala ba'da ayu ala habiti fi Allah Attaqullah wa yu'allamakum Allah If you fear Allah, then Allah will teach you So during this holy month of Ramadan Don't forget to take out time to do some talab al ilm To do something, of course, with the Qur'an and all the other good deeds. And one of the greatest good deeds you can do is seek knowledge. Read some hadith at home with your family. If you're alone, read some hadith alone. Uh, the Quran, tafsir, lots of Quran. But making sure you understand it and you contemplate and you reflect. And one of the best advices that I heard, and this was later, much later into my studies, but I wish I would have heard this in the beginning of my studies and taken this more seriously. And that is to avoid sins if you want to seek knowledge. Because that is one of the most dangerous things to take you from Talib al -Ilm. Because sinfulness causes forgetfulness. Sinfulness, it causes discomfort in the heart. And how can you gain fiqh fi deen? When you have discomfort in your heart, how can you draw nearer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala when you're feeling guilty from the sins that you commit? So my advice to myself and my brothers and sisters in Islam is leave the sins, run from the sins, and seek the knowledge. And the Prophet sallallahu said, Man salaka tariqan yaltalmasuhu bihi ilman sahlallahu luhu tariqan ila jannah. Whoever traverses the path of knowledge, then Allah will make easy for him the path of jannah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all. Jannah to Firdaus, with Jannah to Firdaus, and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us with the class, with the bat, Allah sunnah to Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept our fasting, and accept our zakat, and accept our sawm, and accept our, our Ramadan, all the good deeds we do, and may Allah forgive us of all the bad deeds that we do, and may Allah bless us all to draw near to Him and help the Muslims everywhere, wherever the Muslims are striving, and in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.